Good morning everybody. Welcome to a Monday morning. So this week I thought I would vlog um, <laughs> because um, I haven't done an at-home vlog in so long. I feel like it's it's been forever. How long has it been? So the last day in my life was three months ago, which I actually wasn't expecting it to be that long ago. Um, every time I do a week in my life, the first two days are really lengthy content and then like Thursday and Friday is just like random clips because I forget. <laughs> Maybe I'll just do a few days, like I'll film the whole week, but the whole week will be very like sporadic. Last vlog was my Eras Tour vlog, which was last week. So yeah, that was technically my last vlog, um, but that was, there was only a very small segment in my room. I made a very thought out choice with where I filmed that segment because as you can see, my room is very different. I am so in love with my room, I love it. I'm so in love with how my room is looking, I can't even express. Um, there's a lot on there that um, will not be staying there. I need to sort it out, so it's not done. My room is not done. I still need to order a big mirror. <laughs> My room is not done, but it is so nearly done. When I say that there was just two people literally just stood outside my window of my car just watching me film. That was mortifying. Anyway, how do people vlog in public? It just seems so alien. Um, anyway, we are going to go to the gym. Holy moly. Why is the sun gone? Like, it's, like the sky is completely covered in cloud. Looks like it's going to chuck it down any minute, but... I suppose that's Britain, isn't it? I think I might start editing together the footage I got from like redoing all of my room. There's quite a lot of footage there that I'll have to condense down. Like there's literally like an hour's worth of my phone just filming me paint my wall. <laughs> it's so funny because watching the video, painting is no easy task. I thought that shit was going to be easier than it was, but oh my god, I literally nearly passed out every single time. Um, because every time I did it, it was quite a hot day. Um, and my room was just hot. And I had to get, I'm very small, so I had to like stand on a stool. And every time I stood on the stool, my sight just went black for a few seconds. I mean, I was born literally anemic, like, pfft, <laughs> I've got zero iron in my blood, but, like, it was another level. I was like, oh my god. Anyway, I'm gonna go home, and we're gonna see what we can do today. I might cook dinner later. I've been really into cooking, but I'll just go start when I'm out of this car park. I'm home, <laughs> and Poppy's just been sleeping here the whole time. Um, there's a plane, hang on. Did you miss me? I was literally not even gone an hour. <laughs> yeah, successful gym trip. Can't remember what I said in the car, not gonna lie. When I just got out of my car, I just literally nearly broke my nail on my car door. It hurt. Um, what was it? Oh, I was gonna talk about my cooking, my love for cooking, wasn't I? Um, yeah, so recently, I've always loved cooking um, and baking, but cooking especially, because I'm much more of a savory, person. I'm not a sweet tooth at all. So yeah, I much prefer cooking probably because the results of what I cook are a lot nicer to me uh, because I'll actually eat them. So my parents the other, day, uh, the other week went to Greece for 10 days. So me and my sister were here alone. However, my sister works a job. So she was away all the time and then she also goes to her boyfriend's house on the weekends. So I was home alone for a very, very long period of time um, and I love being home alone. It literally felt like I was just living in my own house alone and I loved it. <laughs> it was just, it was so nice. I love my own time um, and yeah, I also got to cook for myself um, and yeah, I just, I, I love cooking for myself. I love going on TikTok and Instagram and just, like my whole Instagram explore page is just recipes and food. It's all food. 
um, all food or EastEnders spoilers. Uh, <laughs> that's literally my entire uh, explore page. And yeah, all I do is just scroll through reels and find new recipes. I've also been finding loads of cocktail recipes that I really wanna try. If the sun comes out, and yeah, I'm just loving making stuff. Cooking is one of the most therapeutic things to me. So yes, I do have a task for today, I completely forgot. Um, as you can see behind me, I don't know if it's in shot or not, um, these drawers and shelves have been installed so cool they're so cool along with the wardrobe they are like fitted into the alcoves that were once in my room um my desk used to be there and um, what used to be here oh my wardrobe stuff uh, clothes used to be here this has all been fitted however before i put stuff on it i should have cleaned them down because they still have like a plasticky like protection on them um, and they need like a big wipe down. So yeah, so today I need to take everything off, give them a big clean and then put everything back on. What do you want to do today, Poppy? Sleep? I don't know what the point of this whole conversation was. Um, but yeah, that's, I think that that's what I need to get done. I need to wipe down my shelves. Guys, so when we were clearing out my room, we found this, which is my old MacBook Pro. So um, I actually, do not know the funniest thing? When I first posted on this channel, it was May of last year. And I was in my, like, it was like a few weeks before I finished college. So, um, and college, I used to take this with me every single day to do all my work on. This is what I did it on. This is a MacBook Pro from 2012. <laughs> when I say that this is the heaviest laptop I have ever held, with these newer ones, they try and make it seem like you've got a headphone jack and then you've got two USB C's. I think that's the USB C. Um, and that is literally it. That's all you get <laughs> for this. Do you know what you used to get? You used to get a whole ass DVD slash CD player. On this side, look at what you get. You get the charging port. I don't know what the bleeding now that is. You get a lightning, I think that's a US, micro USB. You get two USBs, you get an SD card reader, and you get a headphone jack. An SD card reader is insanity. Like, this is what I use. <laughs> so this is... These are both from Amazon. This is what I use. So this is the USB-C thing and it's got a SD card, a micro SD card, and then three USB um, ports from Amazon. Super good. say it like that good morning it's now tuesday um it's still cloudy where the piss and hell is the sun gone i want to know that today i can't go to go to the gym so we're not going uh, <laughs> um today i don't know what i want to do to be quite honest i really want to cook dinner but my mum 
I'm gonna cook dinner anyway, I don't care. Uh, my mum can reheat it. But <laughs> for dinner, I think I'm gonna make chickpea curry and I'm gonna try and make it super duper spicy because my family loves spice. Um, so, um, and so do I, I, pretty, I really love spicy food. So, I'm gonna try and make it very spicy. Yeah, I don't really have anything else planned for today. Um, I do, I did remember yesterday, I remembered, I looked on my calendar and I've got the dentist next Monday. I hate the dentist. Why am I nearly 20 years old and I'm still going every six months? Tell me that. So like, just let me live. I hate the dentist, by the way. This is why I'm complaining. I know it's good for you. I know I have to go. Um, but like, the reason I am afraid of it is because like, I'm, I, I, the reason I don't want to go is because I'm afraid of it, is what I was trying to say. Um, I, it just terrifies me. It freaks me the hell out. I don't like it. I don't think anyone likes the dentist, but this stuff, I had a dream once. If you don't like the dentist, don't listen to this dream. It'll make it worse for you. Um, but basically, I was watching, I, it was Watchdog. If you don't know what Watchdog is, <laughs> it was years ago. If you don't know what Watchdog is, I think Watchdog used to be its own independent program, but I think it, now it's just a segment on the one show i think it's like how you know argos you know how sainsbury's bought argos argos used to be like individual stores but now most argoses are in a uh, in a sainsbury's it's kind of like that kind of vibe <laughs> this is just british law that no one's gonna get watchdog if you know what watchdog is cool but basically it's just a show talking about people getting scammed and there was one where a dentist like a dental practice bought really cheap uh equipment and um the equipment when they were using it on someone broke and it fell down their throat is that not hell is that not awful um so once i uh, like as a child i used to like have nightmares that the dentist would drop it down my throat oh um and i think that anyone would have that fear of like a, a dental object going down your throat and i just hate the dentist i also have wisdom teeth coming through because i am wise I swear they keep going up and going back down. Is that a normal thing? Like, sometimes I'll feel them out and then I'll feel it again and they're not out. And I'm just like, is that normal? Am I going insane? It's now Wednesday. <laughs> this week is going alarmingly quickly. <laughs> and I am going to the gym this morning. I have realised that every single clip of this vlog so far has just been me talking at the camera. There's been literally hardly anything else. So, I do apologise. <laughs> We've got a problem. So on the way here, the road leading into the gym has got like 70,000 potholes. It's lethal, right? And my car, it's not, it's a tiny car. It's not very sturdy. It's not like a four by four over like big dips in the road. It's not built for that. <laughs> um, so it always sounds quite rickety going over it. But when I was going over it, coming into the gym, it was, um, it's, it sounded like something was hitting it, like hitting the ground, um, like over like a speed bump and stuff. So I was like, that doesn't sound very normal. Um, so I got out my car when I parked. And I think the exhaust, like, I don't know car mechanic, mechanics, so I'm not going to pretend I do. But I think like the exhaust like thing has come off, like it looks scoot with. I was going to go to Asda, but I've told my mum about it. She's like, just go straight home. Be careful. Um, and that's just made me even more nervous because I'm just like, what if I my car just stops working? Like, breaking down is one of the most stressful things I think could ever happen to me. I'm not even kidding. I need to just not think about that. I just, it's not that far home. It's not that far the only really rickety bit of road that I have to go by is getting out of this car park. I could hear it over my music and that's how, it's like, it, I couldn't feel it, but it felt, I could hear it quite a lot. And now I'm just really nervous. That was probably the worst drive of my life. It was awful, the noise is so much worse. It's when I'm revving or like slow speed or on a rickety thing. So something has obviously come loose. So when the car vibrates more, it's making more noise. So something is definitely loose. I'm terrified, um, but I'm home now and I'm never driving this car <laughs> until we have it fixed. It's lunchtime and I have no idea what I'm making. 
both kitty cats have just followed me. One's at the door and one's just at my feet. <laughs> Look at my hair. Right, seems as though I'm ready, but I want to do my hair. <gasps> be slaying um so now i think i'm just going to i think what i'm going to do first is mop the kitchen floor then hoover the living room and then by the time i've hoovered the living room hopefully the floor might be dry probably not but <laughs> um i might come upstairs and hoover up here as well um we have a hoover there um there <laughs> but the um, attachment on the end of it is perfect for carpet. I do not have carpet. Um, and it's, it's, it's made for like really, really tough, like stuff in your carpet. And because it's, it's so, the suction is so hard on it, it scratches my floor. So, and it's the sound it makes, it's horrible. So I'm just going to use the normal one downstairs that's made for like the kitchen floor. So let's go and clean guys. Let's go clean. Just saying, if there is ever a tour date where Post Malone comes on stage and sings the song with her, I will die, kill myself. Oh, vampire 